Okay, so Uchimada, I've always been loved Uchimada throughout my career. Often left on right, I've ended up in a sticky position where this person's controlling the inside and I've come over onto the outside, which is naturally a weaker position because as I come into my attack, this person can kind of resist and push and they're controlling this part of my body. What often happens with traditional Uchimada is I step across, I step in, as I come for the throw, they push and put their hips in and my head comes down and we have no power from there. I stole a little Uchimada that was shown by me by an Australian judoka, um, Morgan Endicott Davies, where from this position, instead of giving them the benefit and time of stepping, you launch yourself in. So if you, if you, if you can see the feet, arm does the same, arms do the same, but the first step steps nice and deep, almost like a front Puranagi. Bang. The next one is going to replace the front foot. And it all happens very quickly. So if Kosai steps to the side for me, it will happen this quickly. Replace, straight leg, and it's the hip that does most of the action. Arms do exactly the same. I'm taking him over these toes. One. Moving. The whole way the arm is doing the same. Leg replaces, 